Welcome back to AB Shop. Today I want to make a test of my new boring head. Uh, it's new for me, but it's not new because it was made in 1971. It's a, a UPE free wallet. So this is the original wooden box. Um, as you can see, it comes from Germany. Here is right in German. It's right Ausdreht Apparat Klein. That uh, maybe it means uh, the small head, because there is also the bigger. That is uh, the UPE4. And this is what you find in inside. You can see that is very very old style. I love it. And here you can see some accessories. So this is uh, uh, these are boring bars. Like you see, so this is a, an AHS steel that uh, you can put here and close with the screw. Okay, you can put it in the other hole here, or you can use also like this, like uh, a giant flywheel, of course. It's not finished because there is a, a second floor. And in the second floor, there is some bushing while missing, but it's not a problem for me that I can make with my date. And some other very interesting tools like this to have a giant flywheel or to work in a inside all in a very particular position. These are new uh, boring bars that I bought, and this is some stop that. Uh, after I will uh, describe. So how this uh, boring head works? So here you have seen a free screw to stop the boring bars. Here there is another one that can be a very strong stop of the in uh, of the head when it's moving. But usually you can use this uh, small nut that push in one sphere and the sphere stop here so there is no possibility to move this there is also uh, two rings one in the upper side and one in the lower side in the internal parts of the hell there is uh, some gears that connect this to this how if you push down this bottom the first gear that now is uh, not connected with the under uh, gear will be connected so uh, this is the road that uh, make one turn and make 0.01 millimeter in the diameter if you turn in this direction if you push down this will be connected you can make a fine adjustment or if the boring head is rotating you insert this one here and when the boring head is rotating this move in one direction or if you push up in the other direction so you can make facing like an end mill but it's not an end mill is a boring head in the other side of the boring head there is this special stop so when you have the side diameter and you move, when this pin touch the stop, he open this button and the lower part will be disengaged from the upper and stop. So it's a stop if you want to make facing, but also it's a stop because you can move when you arrive to the diameter. And to be sure that you go not over this diameter, you can move the stop. So it's very, very, uh, it's a very piece of old mechanics.
what I will try to do with my boring head is uh, this uh, round corner here, one and one. This is not a problem, this, this will be, I think, uh, a problem. And this is uh, what I try to do. So I make some points from here to here. Uh, you see the uh, movement of the boring head of 70 millimeters and I will try to make uh, a line here and uh, a line here. Moving with uh, the X and the Y. The depth uh, is uh, 3 millimeters now from this plane to this plane, from here to here. And now with the X and Y, we will try to move and to make also this corner round, moving in X and Y. Hope to will find a good solution and a good results like this. So the first point is 2.5 in X. So we move at the 2.5. 2.58 0.58 and we close and we go up of 1.9 maybe you hear Now we go to another point that is uh, 6.65, 65, 65 and close and uh, in wide is uh, 5. Okay, now we are in the other side, so we go down. We have finished, now you will see the final results, if it's correct, nice or not. Yeah, this is the final results, uh, not perfect, of course, as you can see, but uh, I am happy. I'm happy because uh, I want this uh, edge round and it is round. Not perfect, but we are at the end of this new video. I really hope to have transmitted a little of my passion for machining, for uh, lathe, for milli machine, boring head, and so on. And I also hope uh, that my work will be useful for those who want to make something similar than what I did. I will be happy to see your comments below. So thanks for watching, baby shop.